ground fault locator function. We have just performed an insulation measurement. As you can see, we have a good, pretty good insulation between negative pole and earth, but absolutely a, a bad insulation between positive and earth. So after performing the test, we just uh, we can just go on the menu, select the find insulation fault, confirm. Now we can just select the number of modules of our string, the nominal voltage of our string, in this case 1500 volts, because as you can see we have a voltage between positive and negative of 1471 volts. The limit set is uh, about uh, 0 0.1 mega ohm. That is the lower limit for calculation of a fault. After that, we can just pressing go. The instrument will take some time to calculate the exact position of the fault. While the instrument is um, performing the, me the measurement that it will take some time, I will discuss with you about uh, the GFL mode. That uh, In this way the instrument is able to give you an indication of where the fold is located on a string. Do it, for example, to water infiltration or humidity on junction boxes of PV modules. The PV isotest measures input voltages and according to the unbalance with, between positive earth and negative earth, it will give you an estimate of the fault location. The instrument, as you can see, we have a very low voltage between positive and earth. Okay, we have lo the location of our fault on the ground between uh, module number three and four.